I'm Judy Shaw for NYC Floor Talk. Joining me today is Prajit Nanu. He is co-founder and CEO at Neom. Prajit, it is wonderful to have you here. Thanks for joining me today. Thanks for having me, Judy. My pleasure. So now, let's start off by talking about the company. What do you do? Uh, mm -hmm. I'm co-founder CEO of Neom. Neom is a global account-to-account, real-time money movement infrastructure. So imagine taxi drivers being paid, hosts being paid, freelancers, contractors, everyone being paid on a cross-border level. We are the core engine which drives those kind of payments. Okay. So now, given the challenges in the broad fintech environment, how are you positioning Neom to be successful? Yeah, I think a lot of fintech is all going to be about scale. Like who gets to how many markets, how many markets can you process money into? And those are some things which we stand out. We are licensed and regulated in about 40 plus markets. We can move money into 200 plus markets. We can access 45 different payment systems across the globe, et cetera. And that's really the infrastructure we've created which really differentiates us. So it's all about scale and execution and that's what we look at and that's what we feel uh, very confident about how we are much better uh, versus our peers. Uh, scaling extremely fast. We grew about 2.6 times last year. We'll grow about 70, 80% of growth this year. Uh, we're looking uh, over 100 million of revenue run rate right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, so real-time payments. Um, there's a broader move to real-time payments that we're seeing. So what are you doing to capitalize on that? Yeah, I think if you think about real-time payments, like US suddenly got fed now, right? Like uh, UK had faster payments, Singapore has fast, India has UPI for years. So now what we're seeing is there's a massive uh, adoption of real-time payments. Imagine if you could click a button and the money is in your account immediately. That doesn't work today. In, in some countries, you can actually get onto a plane, take cash, reach their place and give that person cash. And that's been a faster way of moving money than actually sending a bank to bank payment. And that's what we are solving. So a lot of countries are actually joining the bandwagon. Some of the regulatory work which is being done in Brazil with PIX, India with UPI is phenomenal. Uh, it is going to be a very exciting time in real-time payments. And they'll actually drive costs down lower as well. Because what we've seen is real-time payments that drive around costs significantly. All right, now you are one of the few companies that we are seeing growth from in this market. Tell me, where are you expanding? Uh, Latin America is a huge market for us. Uh, we have a slightly large war chest to go and buy, uh, like be very acquisitive. Uh, we're looking at acquisition targets there. So we are either going to do a build versus buy in Latin America, uh, Brazil, Mexico, Argentina, Peru. These are really large markets for us and we are looking to kind of establish a base and scale out there. And what are the opportunities in these markets? Uh, Real-time payments again, like if you look at what PIX has done in that market, is you can actually send money if you're doing trade, if you're doing, if you're buying something straight and it's instant, it doesn't cost you too much of money and the retailer or the merchant gets the money instantly as well. So we see a significant amount of benefits to the ecosystem. Somebody who couldn't access the money for three to four days now get the money instantly into the bank account. That's all going to drive economy and we strongly believe after having done well in Europe and Asia, uh, Latin America is a big focus area for us. All right. Well, Prajit, wonderful to talk with you. Thanks for joining me on Floor Talk today. Thanks. Thanks for having me, Judy.